beautiful Oregon winter day as we head into the foggy hinterlands of Columbia County. This hill is steep. Well, our target stream is down below us. We took the high road when we needed the low road, and now one of the most difficult things to trek across logging slash awaits. This looks like one of the uh, easier logging slashes that I've seen though, so we're at least good on that. Famous last words. Yeah, this is definitely easier than how I was in or out last time. Nice. Yeah, so here's the falls. We found it the same way we usually find waterfalls. We just were looking at maps for good salamander habitat and uh, places that look like they had really nice deep draws and didn't expect a waterfall to be here too, but here it is. It's kind of a cool one. Glorious. Unnamed, yet spectacular. But now it's time to look for some uh, stream amphibians. See what we can find. Yeah, there's been a, there's been a ton of isopods under here. Oh, here's a dunce salamander right here. You get really close to it. This is a juvenile. He's only about an inch long. Wait, where is he? Right over here. The there, there you go. There we go. They, they get about uh, four or five inches long. They eat the, the little isopods and aquatic insects and everything right on the side of streams. Lay their eggs down in the rocks uh, next to the stream. So they need rocky streams in order to survive. Cool. Don't duns. Do the redback salamander right here. There it goes. Oh, you found a redback now too? Yep. Nice. So Jonathan's found something over here. Yeah, this is a larval coastal giant salamander. They live in these stream systems. They can spend many years, sometimes six, eight years, developing inside the stream before they transform. Some of them never transform and stay in the aquatic form the entire life. They don't like to be out of the water very long, so I'm going to release them back into the water right away. All right, this is a cool little area of this creek. It uh, redirected itself. Used to flow this way, where all the rocks are. Got some kind of log jam. That's going that way. So all the hydrolo hydrologists, hydrology nerds, probably eating this up. A huge alien-looking insect here. I don't think I've ever seen one that big. Yeah, you never know what you might come across in the woods. If you need a new seat for your truck. Or an old seat for your truck. Need some upholstery work. Here's a rough skin newt. Moseyin along this trail. All right, hiking out. Successful venture into the woods. Found that cool waterfall. Found a rough skin newt. Found some dun salamanders. Uh, and found that coastal giant. So 
So, all in all, successful venture. And, uh, you know, join us next time. Wild Columbia, out. Ha, ha, ha.